Hello everyone and welcome to another video. This video is about a game called Waking that was uh, given to me. Um, I'll provide information in the description of developers and all stuff like that. Well, it says at the bottom left there, developed by J.Oda. So this game is called Waking. Um, it's like you're in a dream state or something and you're in this other world and you have to like traverse the land and like kill things. But um, I didn't look into much about the game because I wanted to go in there, into the game with like fresh eyes. So let's see how it goes. Patient Info. Waking is a very personal experience where you play as a character based on yourself. Waking will ask you questions about your life, your friends and your loved ones in order to build out your character. Remember that it is entirely up to you to decide what to share and what not to share. Waking will only store this information in the save file and it will never be used in any way or form other than inside the game for your character. Waking explores sensitive personal themes and allows you to dive into your memories, feelings and emotions. If you have a history of depression, anxiety or self-harm, this game may not be suitable for you. Please make this decision based on your understanding if you're, uh, of your mental health. Okay. You play Waking yourself into your real first name. Okay, uh... Okay. So I'm using the arrow keys to select a letter and then clicking with the mouse to do this. Okay, so my real first name is Paul. I'm male. Uh, that's actually roughly my height. Uh, I'll just say 5'8", because that's the last that I've known my height actually was and I haven't really grown much since. I'm, uh, I'm normal, generally. Uh, I'll do medium. Stick to the middle saying, Are you a content creator making YouTube video or stream? If you select no, you will not be able to monetize your video. You can change this later on the option. Yes, I'm doing a video, yep. Yeah, I think it's loading. So, I'll see you guys when we're in game. Or if anything else happens. The dying mind. Dreams. Okay. One last time. So I'm assuming this is me, this is a character right here. So it almost seems like the the person was in a, a in a coma, and this is like them dreaming sort of thing. Oh, the sensitivity is super high. Oh, that is way too high. This this is like me moving the mouse like one inch, like ever so slowly. So, can I not access, I can't access the menu to, oh my goodness. So I can, I can jump. Oh, that, the sensitivity, oh my goodness. I, I can't even access the menu to change a sentence. Yes, tree. No, no, my life is going great. No, I, I can't, my heart seems to be working fine, thanks. Make peace with the life you have lived. Why should I make peace? With my life is still going on. I'm going to. I, I don't want to get to the light. No, <laughs> I'm fine. Oh, I'm kneeling. Hello. 
So I'm assuming I have to go that way. I want to change the uh, settings. Is it, uh, I'm pressing buttons. Yeah, I, I knew I would have pressed that button. I know you, you, you gather souls or something like this. Oh, so shift is sneak. This must be a mechanic. I need to hear what's this. Hold. Mouse button, okay. I don't know what that did, but I'm assuming it's like a restore point. Oh, maybe. Oh. I don't, I don't want to. No! The sensitivity, honestly, I'm trying to... Right, so that wasn't a restore point, I guess. I need to access the settings, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to... I'm going to how do you even quit? Tab brings up my information. Uh, shift is a sneak. Q... Q? Q is sprint. That's an interesting one. Can I activate this again? Is that an elevator? Did I jump in it? Oh! I'll enter. Okay. It's just like a level select, I guess, then? Interesting. The thing is, how do you even quit? The alt tab just brings me out the game. Um, maybe I'll just do that. So I'll be back in a second. Okay, so we're back where we were. So there was no control system that I can find or settings to change it. But what I did realize was that my mouse uh, has a button on it which can change the sensitivity. So this is me moving it ever so slightly. Now I press the button. This is me moving it ever so slightly now. So the sensitivity is a bit better. So we'll just continue playing from here. Pick up the table. Use table to block attacks. <laughs> okay. Interesting. I didn't even know what was going on there. So, spacebar. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm like a ninja. Whoa. That's pretty cool. Oracle of Desire. Yes. The circumstances of my life filled me with a particular set of desires, and these desires colored my dreams and guided me in my direction. What, besides love, of course, did your soul chase? What were the great desires of your life? Oh, what were the great desires of your life? Select two. Uh, attention, money, safety, beauty, belonging, adventure, freedom, duty, understanding, knowledge, altruism, uh, fun, peace, helping, justice, creativity, influence, enlightenment, perfectionism, and respect. Creativity. Uh, that goes along with like YouTubing and streaming and things like that. So, creativity is one. Your ability added creativity. Hey, let me select another one then. Can I select another one? So, creativity is now gone. Where was that actually? Is, is there an empty podium now? I guess this one's empty. 
Uh, another one was that Dead Sea. Where was it? Hmm, this is a tough decision. Oh, they changed the order of them. Um, I guess fun, because I like to have fun in my life. Why not? Fun. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> so I need to hold left click to make this go up. So fun and creativity. What's happening? What's going on? I feel like this is a bad guy. How you have struggled chasing my desires. Feel them there in your tired heart. Always seeming as if they were just out of reach. I just realised that it's actually like supposed to be like me on the bed. Creativity, fun, and death. May you be free of all desire. So this game is really digging deep into like your emotions and things like that. Right, so I'm assuming I go here. Hiya, ninja! Oh no, I fell off. Whoops. Can can you kill me now? Thanks. Respawn me, thanks. Let's try that again without falling off. The sensitivity still feel a bit high for my liking, but it's the lowest I'm going to get it at. So I have a limited amount of sprint, so is this another thing I can enter? Enter Axon. Ooh, this place seems... Uh, I don't like this place. So it is kind of dark, so hopefully you guys can see okay, because it is a bit of a struggle for me. What's this? Is this a weapon? What's this? It's letting off light. Hmm. Pick up piece of clutter. What, what clutter am I picking up? This? Yeah. Hmm. Uh, Taylor can hold F to aim. And then. Okay, okay. Minus one. Minus sixteen. Why is it minus sixteen? Minus one. Is that the power that I'm using? It's the max power. Minus sixteen. Uh oh. Minus 
minus zero. Minus 16, there we go. Oh, their health is at the top right of the screen. So I'm guessing when it flashes like red with the smoke, that means it's max power. Interesting, interesting. Uh oh, don't fall off the edge. Oh, no! <laughs> uh. You messed me. Wait until he hits again, and then BAM! This time don't fall off. Give me the object! A mist? Okay, interesting. Even though I was holding F. And this should be it. Oh, what's this? My friend. He's, he's giant! How... How dark you are. Well, it's a dark area, so yeah, it's pretty dark in here, yeah. Beneath what you present to the world. Oh, he's moving. I have seen it. Very deep within your psyche. I think that's how you say that word. That ever flowing reservoir of pain. You wanna fight me, bub? Can I jump here? <laughs> the game doesn't allow you. But when you land, it's kinda weird. Okay. Okay, where do I go from here? Down this way? What? I didn't even see that. Where Sauron pain beside? Look where? That message came up fast and went away. And feel the war within. What chains did you wear? What? I can't even read this quick enough. What were the great struggles struggles of my life? Oh, okay, okay. Laziness, weight, disease, greed, jealousy, mental illness, insecurity, trauma, anger, addiction, sorrow, poverty, dishonesty, ego, self-hatred, loneliness, oppression, indecision, and selfishness, and grief. Uh, grief, I would say, as one. Not gonna say why, but there's been grief in my life. Of like losing a pet, friend, or you know, something like that. Uh, what else? Hmm. Ego, sorrow, poverty, addiction. Never really had addiction issues except to energy drinks, so that's not like a bad thing. Um, I can't really see much of these that... Like, I don't see these so much in my life. 
Uh, you know what? I can't make a decision, so let's go for an decision. I can't make choices. So grief and indecision. So maybe that's going to tell the game that I can't make a choice, so it's going to present me with bad choices. What a struggle life is. Be free of your pains. So it's almost like it's saying like the good things in your life. You know, you don't need to achieve those. You could just end your life. You'll be fine. And then the the bad things. It's like end your life. You won't have to deal with them. Uh, okay, so I've been through. It's hard to see where you've been and where you've not been in this game. Am I going to be presented with even more choices? Oh yeah, a ninja jump. Oh, interesting. Looks like I'm getting a sewer. Ah, okay. Hoya! Oh, I can't high jump here. In the dark corners of your mind. We have been toiling away. Building the machines of death that come to quiet the mind. So I can go that way or that way. Let's go this way. Always go left first. What's this? Sleepkeeper machine model Y two hundred. Can I not jump in it? Who are you anyway? It's a sleepkeeper machine. So I can go this way if I want to. Oh boy, this brings me down here. Still not letting me high jump. Can I jump? Can I walk in here? No, I can't. Wait, nightmare machine planning table. So I can't do anything there. Do I need to go to the other side then? Uh oh, turned a bit too much. Uh, refined. Still can't high jump. So, I, so there's nothing there. Do I go here again? Where do I go? I probably missed it. It's probably is around here somewhere, unless I interact with this. But it doesn't let me interact with it. It's not letting me interact with it. So I can go down here. I guess I can. It's 
nowhere over there. So that's like almost seems like as if this would be a guide. Is this the way? This must be the ah. This is the way. So what's this? Sleepkeeper machine again. Okay. Why is it making me go so slow? Oh, there we go. So there's another machine over there. What's over here? Anything good? Right, I'll not use that lift yet. Let's go over here in case there's uh, anything. Ah, it's another sleepkeeper machine. Those look like the, the sleepkeeper machines that I was attacking earlier with the barrels. Is this another decision making area? Fall. Yes. Do you still cling to life? Y yeah. Or will you let the machines have their way? Real deep messages right there. Oh. Okay. Oh, messed that up. Hold F, was it? Yeah. Get wrecked! I'm just holding F the entire time so I care must stay locked on. Yeah, get wrecked machine. Whee! Right, what are you gonna say to me now, huh? Oh, did I go over here? Hmm. Okay, so I beat the the boss machine there. Hi there. Please to meet your somnus. I'll be your envoy to the other side. <laughs> Little insight? Hey, you want a square go, pal? I want to live to go back. I am at peace, ready to die. I want to live! The peace in the afterlife is... Something beyond understanding, heaven, judgment, reincarnation, I don't know and I don't think about it. See so that's something, right, I actually have thought about it, right? There is a possibility that there is nothing, it's just nothingness. There could be something there beyond understanding, there could be something, but not like heaven and not like reincarnation. Heaven, I don't believe in that. I don't believe there's a place like up in the clouds where it's everyone wears white and there's God and everyone is... It's all good. No, I don't believe that. I think heaven's just made up. Uh, it's just my honest opinion. Judgment. Uh, I've never 
thought about that. Never heard on to discuss it. About judgment. Don't know what it could be. Reincarnation. There's been stories in real life where people have claimed that they've been reincarnated. Like they've had vivid memories of a previous life. And even described certain situations that happened in that person's life. And it somehow was true. I don't know how they did it all, but apparently it was all true. But I don't know. Uh, but I have thought about it, but I don't even, I, I don't think there's nothing for sure. I think there is something, but I don't know what. It could be reincarnation, but there's no guarantee of that. But I'm going to say something beyond understanding. New ability added, beyond understanding. I don't want to go towards the light. Ugh, I want to live. Right, I guess there's one more door to go through. That one. So I don't know if this is going to be the end of the game after I do this last area. Because apparently, as I said, the partner's supposed to be fine. If I press tab, it even says melee in those empty slots. And there's level ups. And I've never had to interact with any of these kind of things. I don't know, but I obviously I've took some damage, but I don't know if there's a way to restore health. Whoa! Enter Tunnel of Light. Well, I mean, I guess I have no choice but to continue the game, even though I don't want to enter the light. But, um, I'll probably do this last section and then end the video. Ooh, a tunnel of light. Okay, interesting. What's behind me? Nothing. Is it even possible to see the character's face? Oh, I need to be standing still. No, I don't think it's possible to see the character's face. So, what about the? Sh I mean, the the shape of the body suggests male, but then again, there was that choice of uh, male or female. Do I have a choice now? Who is that? What was that woman's voice? Is this where the actual can game begins? Yes, I can hear you. I'm here for you, Good, I appreciate it. There's another way. Really? Tell me. Really? Meet me there, and I will show you the way back home. Okay. Okay, I'll do that. Okay, so I'm not gonna go to the light. Okay then, I will go back. Over here. Ooh, interesting. I've made a secret exit for you. <laughs> nice. Use the power of insight to open the way. Power of insight added. Hold on, what's this one over here?
Get close to the secret passage. Okay. Press menu to equip. Okay. Not enough neurons. Oh, okay. Interesting, interesting. So what's here? Not yet. Progress saved. So I can't do anything here yet. Yes. Look within. Yeah, you will find the essential tools of your struggle. Protect myself, so do I literally have to protect myself? Um, Oh, nice. I let I let you, I could just stand here AFK. There we go. See, I didn't even press anything. Now use knowledge. These weapons are simple, but powerful. True. Oh damn, these things are strong. Wait, okay. That's easy, okay. Lastly, but most importantly, you must wield your feelings as weapons in battle. Aha! Okay. Each feeling is a melee weapon with a limited amount of uses. You can hold up to three feelings at a time. Hence why the three empty slots here. Interesting. Okay, so I guess I need to How do I equip a weapon then? Ah, oh, right, okay. Um, how do I equip the weapon though?
Oh. Uh, oh, okay. Let me pick up a barrel. So M0 is mouse click, like let M1, and then M1 is M2. Don't shoot me! So I need charm. Oh, wait. There's joy. Wonder. Euphoria. Okay. Let, we've got joy equipped, so let's see what that's like. Knock you down. And target you. And beat you up with joy. Yeah. Can't use insight here, that's fine. Open the chest. What chest? <gasps> Ooh. Give me the chest. Gained the dying minds. That doesn't sound too pleasing. Yeah, let me charge up my weapons. Let's equip that and let's let's go around here and select something else. Fury. Oh damn. Uh so Ah, I'm an evil person. Oh, power attacks you have. Down to enemies to gain power attacks. Triangle fills up as you do damage to enemies. Let's recharge my attacks. I, I, get, I get it, okay. Oh, I see. So use a power attack. Right. And now it's teaching me about sprint. Sprint to the next area. You must learn to battle even when you are weaponless. It just bounced off of him. Oh, I see. Oops, wasn't locked on. Oh wait, do I need to use these triangles on it? Or do I... Oh, I pick them up and charge them. Ah, okay. Ah, okay, I get it now. I get it now. So I need to hit it with barrels when it's down. And it'll drop the triangles and I'll be like, Yo, give me that triangle. Let me charge up my attack. A 
thought there was another triangle there. Uh, I need more barrels. Pick up more. Okay, I get it now. Okay, so I can gain more weapon charges by hitting stunned enemies with objects. Yes! Listen very carefully. Okay. There is one rule you must always follow. Mm hmm. Never attempt to melee an enemy unless it is stunned. Okay. Looks like I'm fighting like one of those guys up ahead. And I regular that will be answered with pain. Always stun, then melee. Okay. Is he stunned now? Yeah, yeah, okay. Well, oh, missed them. Okay. Hey, ya! No empty slots, okay. This makes fighting easy. I'm in the light. I'm out of the light. I'm out. Ooh. Uh, I don't know if the progress saved. I hope it did. I, I don't know if it saved or anything, but I am going to end the episode here. I don't know if I'll do another one, but the the game does really run deep. So, uh, thanks everyone for watching, hopefully you enjoyed it. If you like this game, feel free to pick up and experience your own emotions uh, playthrough. I don't know if it's different based on the options you like, like uh, your desires in life and then your uh, the bad things in your life. Uh, so, hopefully you enjoyed, take care, and goodbye.